What is up guys, welcome to the video and today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Celestron 4SE telescope. So let's get right into the video and I really hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, so this is the telescope, it's a huge box and yeah, we're going to get right into this unboxing and we're going to cut this open. Okay, so this box is really big and I'm going to start off by letting it open here. There's the telescope box, and I'm gonna try and lift it out of the box. Okay, so now we're gonna cut open the telescope box. Alright, so we have one more box, and let's hope this is the box that the telescope is in. boxes in this box we just opened up there's also this little manual thing all right so it looks like there's four boxes in here and i think they're all separate parts of the telescope i'm going to cut this box open okay so inside this box there's another box and we'll get to that one in a minute inside this one i think this is a tripod for the telescope to stand it up feels pretty durable It's packed inside this bag here. So let's get to the other boxes. Okay, next we have this box that was in the box from the tripod. And this looks like the little tray for the different lenses that you can put inside the telescope to look at different things. So this feels like pretty good steel. And it also comes with this little wrench for putting it together. And this also seems pretty durable too. So let's get to the next box. Okay, next we have this little square box here. So there's some more bubble wrap, and there is this kind of sight looking thing here, it's like. Kind of looks like a sight from a gun. And there's another box, and this cable, and this little level here. Inside this box, there is a lens. It feels pretty heavy and pretty good quality. So I'm just going to leave that in the bag because it seems delicate. And I'm also going to leave this little level in the bag because I don't want to lose it. Alright, so moving on to the next box. Next we have this box, I'm guessing this is the actual telescope. So this one looks like it's packaged really well. And there's tons of styrofoam in here. But there is our telescope. All right, so here's our telescope. Get out very gently. So this is also what some people call a computerized telescope because as you can see here, there's a keypad and you can type in some kind of numbers or whatever and the telescope will move on its own to point at that star or find it for you so you can track it. But yeah, I'm gonna get to assembling this. It also looks like it moves like that. So we're gonna start assembling this and I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. You can see here the legs of the telescope also extend. Alright, so as you can see here, I got the telescope mounted on the tripod. It was actually really easy. There's only three screws, just like that one right there. The remote it comes with is actually modular too. You can take it off and plug it back in with this ethernet cable looking thing. It also has a battery compartment in there. The lens is really, really shiny. Here's a little close up of the keypad. As you can see, there's a bunch of different things on it, like solar system, stars, deep sky, and stuff like that. You would type one of those in and then it would be able to move itself, which is very helpful. There's also this cable. Now, I think this is if you wanted to hook it up to one of your own devices because you can plug this in the camera slot there or the aux slot if you wanted to plug in your camera to take pictures of what you're looking at, which is really cool and also helpful. So I think that covers everything. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Really hope you guys enjoyed the video today. And if you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome videos just like this one. If you want to get one of these telescopes yourself, you can get them for $400 on Amazon, and I will leave a link down below. So anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and have an awesome rest of your day.